With the U.S. housing market skirting along at record lows as far as 20 years back and banks holding off on mortgage lending, many real estate sales don't ever make it to the closing table. But concierge auctions has found a way around that with an increasingly popular type of luxury real estate sale, absolute auction. Everything from Cher's Hawaii home to pre-revolutionary war estate Tulip Hill has sold at the strike of their gavel. The most unusual part? Unlike most auctions, these properties are not foreclosures. We tend not to do a whole lot below two and a half million dollar sale price. Uh, we are all over the country. Uh, we have been most active over the last three to five years in secondary home markets. Usually what happens is we get a call from the owner or their agent. Uh, their house has been on the market for an extended period of time. Our sellers tend not to be people that are distressed. They tend to be people that have decided that they want to move on in their life. When a seller lists a property with concierge, potential buyers have four to five weeks to visit the estate order an inspection and gather funds together for bidding. Properties auction off at the best number offered and the winner has 30 days to close. According to Graham, buyers fit one of three profiles. People have already seen the home and maybe put up a past offer. People generally looking in that market and people who aren't necessarily planning to buy but see a listing that piques their interest. Are there ever examples of homes that don't sell on the auction block? Or are there ever examples of homes that sell below the market price on the auction block? Um, our process is designed to uh, make sure that we can get the type of active bidding and participants to show up for an auction that we're comfortable that the market price is going to be achieved. We would never let any home go to auction if we didn't feel that we were going to have enough bidders to generate a fair market price. The Sotheby's preferred auction house has more than 10,000 luxury properties in its database and has sold more than $36 million worth of U.S. residential real estate in the first half of 2010 alone. Now listings are coming in from international locations like the Cayman Islands. The unique aspect of our auctions, which is different than regular brokerage, is you know, when the gavel goes down and you sign a contract, the property is going to sell. We have not had a fallout in a contract in our business in the last two years.